Hello and welcome to an all new Comic Corner. I am as always Steven. Now today we are talking about Unicorn. This is the second printing from Scout Comics. Um, I got it because I, I don't know, I, I kind of dug the cover and I can't remember what the price was but I think it was cheap. I had heard people talking about it so I was like what the hell. I picked it up. Now, supposedly it is uh, under option from Armory Films uh, to make a movie. Uh, I'm not sure with the COVID how far that's gone. But um, it's going to be a 120 page or a little bit more than a 120 page graphic novel. Um, it's supposed to be out in December of this year. I think it said December 7th. So this is basically a teaser trailer for the full graphic novel. Ultimately, um, it's a good um, introduction. You meet the main character, um, Maeve, who, uh, her father doesn't talk to her much except for when they're arguing, and, um, her mother is dead. There was a accident, uh, while the mother was driving, her and May were in it, and May made it out, and they couldn't find the mother. But her mother used to be a veterinarian, and they had a farm. The farm was sold to this old lady, who the father says is crazy, and um, she takes care of um, all the stuff, all the animals. I'm assuming most of the animals that were there, or at least one in particular, was there when uh, the family lived there. Uh, because the mother was a vet, her office was on the farm, and stuff. So, uh, she goes and helps the old lady feed the animals and do chores before school. And, uh, the only two rules are she can't go in the vet's, I mean, the, her mother's office. And, and two, she cannot, um, go near the horse. So, uh, she helps a woman, and on this day, the old woman is feeling, um, not well. So, instead of both of them going to tend to the horse, Maeve goes in there herself. And while she's in there, there's like a line that says, do not cross, in front of the horse stall. And there's a sign that says, beware a horse. So she's behind the line, pushing the feed into, like, the area with a broom. And the horse is making a racket. So she opens the stall and sees that it has a hat or a cap on it. And it's stuck to a hook on the wall. So she fixes the horse, and the horse is, like cool with her and stuff and the old lady comes in and is like nobody's uh that horse hasn't been nice to anybody since your mother died that was your mother's horse so uh long story short the old lady lets the girl into the thing and she finds this old book which is uh written in several different languages she goes to school and um, she tries to start deciphering it. And some kid, one of her schoolmates, uh, tries to help her. And they find out it's a book, it's like a guide, an owner's manual for a unicorn. Um, with a K, I believe. Which means it's a unicorn that's had its horn cut off. And there's a picture in it of 
her horse. And right around there is where it ends. Uh, she, there's a page that's bent over, like, dog-eared. She opens it up and it shows a horn on her horse, or her mom's horse. So, uh, she finds out or theorizes, um, that the horse is a unicorn. And that's where it ends. Um, the end kind of, um, drew me in a little, because I'm curious, how does the horse go from being a uh, unicorn with a little stub on its head, uh, go into a full-fledged unicorn? And I might buy the graphic novel just to check it out. It seems interesting. Like I said, this is basically a teaser trailer for the graphic novel. So, it won't be everybody's cup of tea. But, for what it is, it's decent. And I can't remember what I paid for it. I think... Uh, I can't remember if it goes through Scoot. If it's Scoot, it's two bucks. But... If it's actually skeletons, it doesn't say. I don't know how much I paid for it. Um, but it's somewhere between two and four bucks. Normal go on price for scout comics. And it's worth checking out. I mean, the worst that happens is you don't like it. Give it to a child. A uh, kid might like it. If for nothing else, the artwork. And I geared more towards uh, children because the graphic novel is classified as a YNA young adult young child uh, novel and I guess it's supposed to deal with uh, the losing of loved ones and stuff like that so uh, yeah check it out have you read it if so let us know what you thought about it in the comments section below I am curious like I said I liked it it is what it is a uh, teaser trailer for a bigger um, story. A story that um, there's like a 32 to 96 percent chance that I'll check it out. So with that, I'll see you next time. Have a good day.